first grade mathematicians, how are you? It's good to see you again today. Yesterday we were working on some addition story problems. We drew pictures, we wrote the number sentence, and we solved story problems in our own life, our own math problems. And so I want to do that again today. So I'm going to share one that I created, and then you're going to have a chance to do the same. I'm going to read it to you. I went to the park. I saw 10 pink flowers. A little girl picked three flowers. How many flowers are left? You may be thinking in your head of a strategy to do to solve this. There's lots of ways you could go about it. Your thinking could be very different than mine or than any of your other first grade friends. And so I want you to spend a minute just to think about how would you solve this? What would you do? Let's take a look. Well, in this scenario, I went ahead and I X'd out three flowers because once they're picked, they're gone. They went home with the little girl. Now there are fewer flowers at the park. Okay, you can see we had 10, take away three with seven remaining. There are seven pink flowers left at the park. I want you to visualize yourself at the park, maybe at the playground at your school or a park near your home. And I want you to try in your packet on the last math page that you have. Um, it says draw a math subtraction story about playing at the park. Okay, and then write a math sentence to solve. All right, give it a try. Off you go.